Hello guys, Alex here again and today I'm going to show you how to make something interesting. It's some vehicle, so if you want to make this vehicle you probably need to watch this tutorial. It's a tank. It's not the regular tank that you can find in Google or YouTube with round turret standard. It's Tank Destroyer. I watched some tank from real life. So I will first make the tank and then you will guess what is it. I'm just kidding, you will read on the start of the video because that's the name of the video. It's Jack Panther Tank Destroyer. So let's start. This is the upper part of the hull and you need to make something like this. Size of these pieces are 132. You need you have seven pieces in first row, then put six pieces in second row and in third row you put seven, but these two are gray or black pieces or any color you want. This is some decoration for the tank. You don't need to put it, this if you don't want to. And then put on top of this gray piece, two gray pieces like this, one on top, like this, and on the other side too. This is some kind of ventilation fan, I don't know exactly, something like that. But we need some details just gun and tracks like this and now fill this with any color you want I choose this maybe you can choose some other color green or any color you want it doesn't need to be gray color and I'll put six pieces on top. Yeah, seven pieces on top. This is some kind of, I don't know, desert camouflage, you can call it that. You can make with white paper then it's for winter or you can make regular grey color tank. Just continue with this, 6767. Six, And what, do what I do. Simple. You have three main parts of the this tank, and that's the upper part of the hull, bottom part of the hull and the super structure. So that's the three parts you need to make and rest is tracks, wheels and gun and some decorations because I like to decorate so it look more realistic. don't need more much to make. This is all pieces you I need for this. So you know, it's not the biggest tank in the world. This is the smaller version. So you don't need much paper and you don't need too many time to make this but it looks good enough. 
I don't know how it looks because I didn't made it yet. And one more, like this. So I finish this, it should look like this. And then all you need to do when you make this, put on some hard surface and then this front part just put down like this so here better angle how many rows we have here fifty fifteen rows that's it so we make this fifteen rows and that's it now bottom part of the hull you need to make something like this I don't show you step by step, it's not so difficult. You have first row inverted and then all rest of the rows are normal and you put 4-3-4-3 four, three, four, three formation. That's it, simple. How many rows with this first we have? Thirteen. But you can I cannot tell you how many you need. I put 13 because it's good enough for me when I put this at the bottom it's okay for me you see but if you put two hard pieces one on each other and push harder maybe you need more rows or you don't put even as I do so you need less pieces, I don't know. i just tell you how many I use. So when you make, you will just put one to each other like this and you will see. So this is the bottom part of the hull and you will glue this one to each other. And this is why you need inverted row in this first because we have same angle. If we put here, we will have different orientation of angle and this is same thing so that's it so now let's make this super structure how to make this you need to make same size as this upper hole how you need first row is inverted seven pieces and then you need to put five more rows of normal pieces so you put next row is six pieces per row seven pieces six pieces seven pieces six. And like that and now in next row what you need to do you need to put three gray pieces on top here like this and then two same color pieces this at the side a little bit all you need to do is match angles so you have same angle like this so 
so you see it should look something like this he have some machine gun here so you can make that machine gun take one black piece same size make some circle like this and then take one piece small or same doesn't matter you can glue there in side of this and then you can put somewhere around here and then put like this you can put like that I'll glue everything later and show you how it all looks it's not so difficult you can put this part like this a little bit in this pieces put inside if you want you don't need to all you need to do is to match same angle that's it and now put here machine gun and here it goes gun for the tank so how to make gun you need to make this And this is 164 size of piece. Put, for example, five, five pieces and make this. This is 128 size of piece. And then put inside of this. Like that. And then for end of the gun, you can make one piece 164, put inside one black piece, and then just put inside here. Like this and then just put here when you glue everything of course like this of course you need to be straight And now let's make tracks. You need to make this first. You can double every piece on this vehicle by double. Double by double. Interesting. You can double size of every piece, so this maybe should be 164, not 128. Eight if you don't like to make this size of pieces and this is 128 but you don't need many pieces for one wheel so I will only put one two rows so this is the base practically this is the base you need to make base of 10 pieces per row and first row are inverted and that's it you need to make for one track you need to make three wheels and fourth wheel is like this so this is the first wheel on the tank and you will put that wheel here on bottom part of the hull and then three of them 
one to each other. How to make track? This is my design of track, I hope you like. I didn't glue this, so it's not so good looking. You need to glue this everything. I just want to show you how to make better track than that when you put, when you make like this, to make track like this, look how fat that track is, you need to make this big tank to make this kind of tracks, it's not so good, but this is best for these smaller tanks if you make. So that's it, how to make this, simple, take one piece, this is one, one 32 size piece and bend this part and then close and you got one unit for tracks and then make around 20, I don't know, depends on your size of tank and how you put pieces, you will see how many you need and then just put like this, don't put all the way in like this, you can put but you need uh, three times more pieces and it's not look really well because you don't have this triangle space here and like this if you put you have and then glue every piece and then you just bend and when you bend you can bend easily nothing go out or spread or something as you can see they can fit inside with no problem and then where to put tracks I will show you later but you will glue this whole hull one on each other like this and then tracks goes here like this and then you will glue it will be a little bit tighter not that tall like this and then four wheels down on both sides and that's it one one more thing or two more things what I made for this tank is this this is you know the tanks have some details on it so we'll do this here or I don't know how you like maybe like this you can go like this. This is part of the track. So on both sides I will glue this part of the tracks for accessories. And then exhausting pipes. Like this. I will glue there. Two pipes with black paper. This is one 32 size piece. And you see how to make just need to valley fold this back and make this and then you cannot put you can glue like this but just bend this inside these two parts so you have a little bit to glue inside that's it you make two of them and then glue and that's it and you can spread this hole a little bit to have some realistic look and now I will do everything and show you how it looks. So guys, I glue everything. And now it should look like this. Glue is not dry yet, but I will show you how it looks. So I have one more thing I put. Is this track covers same thing as tracks but with different color same color as this rest of the tank just put inside on both sides and that's it it look better with that than without it I put this one more thing this wheels when you make them better glue every piece because I have too much problem put that there <coughs> putting that there because they are so tiny and I, I didn't glue them so better glue every piece and you don't gonna have any problem 
to finish that. That's pretty much it. I hope you like this tank because it's tank destroyer. So if you do like this tank you can like this video and this tutorial and share this video and you can subscribe to my channel if you're not a subscriber of course for more videos you can use this method to make other tanks only thing you need to make is turret because these tanks tank destroyers don't have turret just put one turret and that's it you just make that but this principle you can use for any tank i hope you like this model so guys take care i see you soon bye